<laughs> I'm going to read you guys a journal entry. <laughs> it's an unconventional journal entry, though. It's not like, dear diary, today I pooped. It's <laughs> <laughs> you can guess what my journal entries are like, so you can find out anyway. <laughs> last night, oh, last night, up to my old tricks again, but whipped out a load of new ones. Got a hoo! <laughs> On my way home, scooping and singing, spotted a live party at the AGO. Oh, oh, let me see, let me see, let me see. Daddy, lift me up, I want to see. Diddly dee 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 dee. Two ladies, sexy, classic, smoking. I said, what's going on here? She said, a party. Hey, I like to do that. And I think wear my dancing shoes and my fedora hat. Can I get in? Is this thing free? She said, honey, if you want in, you're going to need me. <laughs> then with a lick of her wrist, she put her stamp on to me. And that's how Wonder got into the party. <laughs> what? <laughs> now, what about this gold check? Ain't got no money. But I do give a conversation and a wink and a smile when I can't tip because I'm hip. So she took my jacket, the holy shit, security. They're gonna let me in? If they don't, I'm just gonna go home and put my ass to sleep like I was gonna do anyway. No sweat off my back, but now I've been staring at the security guard's rack and she says, sir. <laughs> <laughs> And that's no joke. I just had to step out for a smoke. And then I showed the scam blue smudge on my head. Still smelling sweet because that lady licked it on to me. She said, mmm. <laughs> Next time, have your ticket on you, sir. Now get your ass in there and have a drink on me. And that's how one we're going to do the party. <laughs> <laughs> Orders with little toothpicks looking fancy. I've been eating sandwiches and beans and soup and other canned food. So I picked up five of these, six of these, seven of these cheesy spinach, artichoke, spiral, fellow pastry things that taste tasty in my way. I eat them whole. <laughs> <laughs> well, I spot all the people lining up for something. So I got myself into that line. I want to see something too. And that's when the ladies started talking to me. Mm. <laughs> They're asking why we're lining up here. I said, maybe, maybe, so we can meet each other tonight. What's your name and how you feel? She said, hmm, I like you. What's your name and where's your drink? I said, my name is Wanda. Then I got Frank. I said, baby, I ain't got cash for that. She said, cat, it's an open bar. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, my name is Wonder, and I'm an alcoholic. <laughs> and, and I like to smoke cigarettes, and ganja. And, and, and then I, I hit the bottom and pack a bowl and roll a split, and let it go smoky pop pop pass that shit. And then I laugh and I dance and I sit some more and I ha 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 ha, mm, baba zuzu, and I'm trying to recover. <laughs> but tonight, fuck that shit, I'ma get drunk on someone else's dime, cause it's about the time for me to climb to the top of top of top of this party. So, I get to the end of that line, and it ends in this big old elevator. It was a hell of an elevator. And it went up, 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 to the third floor, and it was one of these nightclubs where the music goes, and you can't dance to it without doing this and looking sexually frustrating. I don't like to dance like that. It's sending people the wrong message. But I did hit up the bar, and I got a one-two vodka, one-two three beer into me. Then I met a Cynthia Leanna and Ali Jane. She had feathers in her hair. She wasn't so plain. And then I lost her. And I met a fella named, oh, what was his name? It was a, uh, oh, oh, Tello, oh, Tico, something like that. But, but this man had spotted my hat and then acknowledged me as one fly cat. And I could see his dreads and tattoos. And I knew this brother had it going on too. And that's when I asked, homie, what you do? He said, music, man, that's what I do. I said, what a coincidence. Because me too. <laughs> then I said, brother, what you doing here? Because you seem like me, and this ain't my scene, and I'm complaining an awful lot for someone who got it for free. And he said, the real part of is in the basement. And that's what I'm talking about, and I knew by the look in this brother's eyes that that's where the hive of jocking honeybees be at, and that's my cat Nip, you see. <laughs> so I got back into that big old elevator, the woman running that hell of an elevator said, sir, you can't bring that beer in here. <laughs> I say it was half empty anyway because I'm an optimist. <laughs> and then I got in that elevator and she'd take me down, down, down to the basement and then I heard that hip hop. That funky soul music that make you move how you move and you look natural and you don't look sexually frustrated. If anything, you'll have some clothed up sex on that dance floor. 
And with the good music in the air, I got another beer, you know that. And then I got on that dance floor with that Jay-Z, Alicia Keys, and Rihanna, will you marry me, please? <laughs> then I saw my fly friend Stevie. And you know there ain't nothing like a good drunk reunion, am I right? Right. Am I right? Right! So I haven't seen Stevie since before Christmas, and I had a good old drunk reunion, lovey dovey huggy with Stevie, and then Stevie says, you gotta meet somebody. So we get back on the dance floor, and I'm walking and looking, and I see this sexy dancing red haired woman, and in my mind I'm saying, ooh, please be you, please be you, please be you, please be you, ooh, please be you. And then Stevie drops me off right in front of this fiery woman, and we start dancing like we've done it a hundred times before. And we start touching each other like we know each other. And her sweet smelling hair is in my face and I'm twisting her and turning her and dipping her like she an ice cream cone. <laughs> <laughs> and this is how I met Mandy. <laughs> so I go to the DJ and normally I, I don't like telling the DJ what to do because the DJ is the puppet master and the puppet don't tell the puppet master what to do. It's not a cool look, but when it's about the puppet having sex, <laughs> I make an exception. <laughs> <laughs> so I go over to the DJ, and there was this DJ, another fine as a dime, tight ass looking one. I'm thinking, no, 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 focus, focus, focus. I'm a man on a mission. I say, Miss DJ, how you doing? You having a good time? Oh, that's mighty fine. Do your thing, girl. Get paid. Do you have any Biggie Smalls? <laughs> <laughs> and she said, hmm, I got you, baby. I got you. I hear what you're saying. I see you. I feel you. And I got you. You get back on that dance floor. And so my brown ass drive back onto the dance floor, and all the two dances later, Yo, this album is dedicated to all the people who told me I would never amount to nothing. All the people who called the police on me when I was just trying to make some money and feed my daughter. It's all good, baby, baby. And now, I was testing this woman. See, if I don't know if a girl can really get down or she's just putting up a good front, I throw on Biggie to see if she got it. And this girl didn't. <laughs> So sad. <laughs> <laughs> but about three paces left, there was this fine looking mama, fine, fine, fine chest who was getting down to Biggie like she do it every day. Hey, me too. <laughs> <laughs> and then Miss DJ got back on the mic and called last song, and that hurts me more than last call for alcohol. But I guess that's all right, because I did have a good night, and I did get in without a penny or a fight, so I kissed my red haired woman good night, and then shuffled over to physically take flight. With the fine, dark hair, dark skin, nighttime eye, mama looking at me since the biggie. And three seconds later, she pressed that rack on me and boogie up and down and up and down and up and down and up and down like I'm an old time washing board. <laughs> <laughs> and I said, What's your name? She said, Diamo. I said, I know what your name means in Espanol. And she said, Hmm, you're fresh. I did agree, yes, yes. She asked, How old are you? I said, I put it this way, baby. In one year, I'm 22. She said, if you were older, I'd be interested in you. I said, hmm, how old are you? She said, I'm a mother of two, and one of them's old as you. <laughs> so we kissed goodnight. <laughs> got consoled with my beer, went to coach at, got my shit, it's about time to leave here. My whole trip home, I'm laughing at me, because instead of going home and going to sleep, I had beer and music and vodka and Biggie and ladies and dancers saw Stevie and jumped and jumped and whale for free, all because I got into the party. There you go. <laughs>